Shouldn't have had that last one. Come on, sir. Try to remember. What really happened at Sylvia's saloon back in 76? Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Who's your friend there? Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Luzi Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. Well, how's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. OK. Then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity. Shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but. You want me to go and find some. Sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. OK. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Taking this one in.
Hamish, Arthur, come on in. So, how you keeping out here? Ah, keeping fine, thank you. So it's all right then, is it? Living out here, away from civilization? <laughs> civilization? Yeah, I saw what civilization and industrial advancement will get you into war. Progress, well, it ain't always progress. Besides, I ain't lonely up here. I got company. Well, I ain't company. Come look at these. Remember catching that? <sighs> I do. <laughs> I know you ain't forgot about him. Oh, I still see him in my dreams. <laughs> yeah, I got the whole of nature up here. And I'm gonna make the most of it, as long as there still is some. Whoa. They weren't lying. What's that? Right there by the outhouse. Look at the size of that boar. <sighs> Holy hell. I saw some cattle gourd the other day, but I didn't think it was possible. Let's go take care of it. Okay. Damn, I thought I got him. Pursue. I'll grab the mounts. Stop there. Out of them. Don't worry. Traps go this way. Come on. Oh. Yep. And fast, too. Yeah, but we'll get him. He came through here, all right. Big shit. He's been across here twice. What'll we do? Well, he's been up this hill to the right, and down this one in front of us. But I can't tell which tracks is fresher. Let's split up. You go up, and I'll go onwards. Okay. Hey. Good luck to you, sir. Pia! Come on, you!
уже. Got thrown and a bastard hog got me. Uh, take a bill for me, would you? He's a good horse. He may be stubborn, uh, but he's strong.
Who are those two creepy fellas over with Micah? Two guns, he knows. What the hell are they doing here? I have no idea. <sighs> Arthur, I'm, I'm real scared. This, this ain't good. You're gonna be okay, but be ready. Just be ready. I understand. Arthur. Where'd he go? I, I don't know. He left me a note. Told me I should do the same. Why? Well, I think he's worried. <laughs> he's a right to be worried. You worried? Sure, but I still think maybe things will turn out okay. You, you'll steer Dutch right. I know you will. I'll try, Miss Grimshaw. Really, I will.
So why are these two still here? Old pals of Micah's. They're getting real comfortable. We need guns for what's coming. Cleet and Joe know how to fight. <clears throat> it's lucky I bumped into them. What is going on, Dutch? What is happening to us? What's happening to you? You show him some respect. Excuse me. Mr. Vanderlyn, Mr. Morgan, Charles! They try to kill my people for oil! For oil! Today we ride once more. Ride with me, ride with us! Ride with us against the factory! I love your courage, son. It is a thing of great beauty. Stop! Everyone, stop! My son, my last son, don't. When I was your age, I fought. I saw death. I have killed. The men I knew were slain. My firstborn, your brother, had his head smashed by a drunken soldier. My wife had her throat slit. I made peace. I knew not to trust, yet I had no choice. Maybe you were right. Maybe the slow death is worse than the fast one. Maybe none of these men are good. Maybe a world in which they came to us is a world that we cannot endure. But endure we must. Father, you are tired. Do not die for pride, my son. We have suffered too much in this trick. The earth, the water, they have no pride. They endure. And we must endure. My only boy, my precious boy, do not mistake my strength for weakness. As your chief, I implore you. Your words mean nothing to me, father. Don't. Run with me, now! Stop. Please, stop. Please. Mr. Morgan, have to help me after we spoke. This is just a trap. My son, my people will all die. You help this fellow, Arthur? Please. What of it? What else you been doing behind Dutch's back? What? The wars are over. We have lost. These young men will be annihilated. Please. I'll see what I can do, Charles. Who else will come with me? No, oh, I'll ride, Arthur. Who knows what other secrets I'll learn about. Who else? I will. And me. Me too. Oh, and me. I guess. All right. Let's ride out. have you been doing behind my back, Arthur? I was trying to stop this mess from getting any worse. You think that didn't work? Why the hell would they attack the oil fields? What do you mean? It's perfect. This was your idea? Partly. The army, the government, the industrialists. They've taken everything from these people. Wouldn't you want to fight back? Handed them a death sentence. Just like John, if we hadn't got him out of that prison. Hey, show some goddamn respect. You'll know when I ain't showing respect, Bill. I had a plan. I still have a plan. What plan? What goddamn plan, Dutch? Tahiti? Timbuktu? That's enough. What's wrong with you all? What happened to loyalty? Yeah. What did? Thank you, Javier. Bill, right now, it doesn't matter how we got here. These men need our help. I have a plan. This is the plan. So either stick with me or cut loose. Because I am tired of this constant descent. Long tired of it. Now come on.
Look up ahead. It's one of them. Are you all right, son? Eagle flies. He needs help. They all need help. Quick. Somebody help no. him. No, go. Please hurry. I'll be. Come on! these men. Anyone see eagle flies? There. Going across the walkway. Got what you want, Dutch. You coming, Arthur? I'm gonna try and save him. This fight is unwinnable. If you go and distract them and let me get to him. Have it your way. The rest of you, ride with me. Let's meet up at the factory. Let's ride! Yeah! Go with them. Try and help there. I'm better off alone. We're riding with you. Come on, then. by the factory. That's where Dutch is gone. Let's go, quick! Any men we see, we must save them. Let's find the others. We need to get to the factory town. Where's Colonel Favors? Send him out here. Hunter, come on.
Let's find the others. We need to get to the factory building. Where's Colonel Baker? Send them out here. Kill these sons of bitches. Bunch of cowards. This regiment is a joke. Let's move on. Kill these sons of bitches. Bunch of cowards! Uh, uh, 
So good of you to join us. Hello, son. Hey. Saved your life. He did. Hey, you're quite the hero, Arthur, ain't you? Just a regular good guy. Same as always. What is it with you, Arthur? What is it? I don't get you. I don't get you no more. Oh, the doubting. The doubting. Come on! Get him out of here! All of you! Come on. Let's go finish things. Finish what? Oh, the doubts. You know why I wanted them to attack this place? I have no idea. <laughs> Javier, you get them and you go. Until I find all my men. I'm not leaving. As you wish. Rest of you, get out of here. I'm staying with you. We're getting our ticket out of here. We need to find the office. It's upstairs on the other side. I broke in here before to get those papers for Eagle Flies. That's better, Arthur. A little help. Come on, son. What are we looking for? Money, you fool. The money. There's state bonds here. Lots of them. I thought you were paying attention. Old Cornwall had a deal with the state. He was being paid to develop the region against the federal government's wishes as they didn't want problems with the Indians. Anyway, so we get it. We're done. We're almost free? Yes. If we're right, we've had tough times, the toughest of times, but come on, don't doubt me no more. Search the place, I gotta be here somewhere. No. I've been here before. Check that cupboard by the door. It's a, a few thousand dollars worth, maybe more. <laughs> oh, we are nearly there. Arthur, we're nearly there. Mr. Morgan, let's go home. Let's get out of here, Arthur. Come on! You 
I saved my life more than once to give mine for yours. It's as it should be. Come on. We need to go. You. You ran away. Oh, I did no such thing. Don't be a fool. They could be back here any minute. We did it, gentlemen. Oh, we got some money. And with the train job? Well, we got a whole lot of money. Come on. Everything is coming together. Exactly as I planned. I've got to take the boy to his father. As you wish. Usually he is nowadays. Sure. <clears throat> Come on. We got to get back to camp and prepare. Let's ride. I'll be back when I can. I'll stay with you. And me, of course. And so will I. No, get out of here. Please. This ain't gonna be nothing nice. Be safe, Arthur. All right, come on. Let's get him to what PT as fast as we can. Hold on, my friend. Our men. Uh, we must go back for the bodies. We will. Save your strength. My friend, I'm sorry. About this. About all of this. You have nothing to be sorry for. You know, Dutch, Dutch is, I guess my thinking is he used you. He wasn't trying to help anyone but himself and his own crazy principles. Okay, stick with us, Arthur. Back to what you were saying. We're grown men. Nobody made us do anything. Maybe I'm talking for my people as much as for yours. We saw he turned crazy, and we couldn't believe it, and we followed him anyway. Things should never have gone this far. You've seen the situation on the reservation. Better to die fighting than sick and weak. Maybe, but you... Your people deserve better. You okay, Charles? Not really. All this death, and for what? Just so we can have enough money to be able to run away from what we've done? There used to be some... some reason to. Lines that couldn't be crossed. We even helped some folk. Those lines... have been gone for some time now. The time has come for us to draw our own lines, Arthur. Decide where we go from here. I swear, back there... Dutch just stood and watched. If it wasn't for Eagle Flies, I'd be... I know. I feel like he's descended into the kind of man he told us never to be. Maybe. He's just become more who he really is. I don't know anymore. I just feel like a fool. That money, those bonds, whatever it is. I don't want a cent. There's too much blood on it. Let's just get this boy to his father. friend here, my friend, he's a brave man. Fearless. Always has been. This won't be in vain. We will try to round up more men from the north, wherever we can. Many are ready to fight. No. This is over. For all of us. Peta. Yes. Uh, Peta. It's okay, brother. Save your breath. We're not too far. Come on! Don't die, brother! Not yet. Done, Eagle Flies. We're getting you home.
Bring him to me. My son. What are you gonna do now? They must move. And fast. I'll stay and help them. I'll stay too. No, my friend. You have others who need you. Good people. I'm sorry, but we... We must pack and move. Brauchten. Und jetzt können wir sie nicht retten. Aber, aber. Duh. 